Hi everyone, it's great to see you all. I know I'm one of the last pitchers on a Friday, so you're bloody legends for still being here. Um, I want to ask you guys two quick questions to start. So, put your hand up if you know anybody, privately or professionally, who you think would benefit from some really good therapy. Put your hand up. <laughs> okay, keep your hand up and put your other hand up if you think you personally would benefit from some really good therapy. Oh, I love that. A lot of, a lot of honesty in the audience. <laughs> so, and I forgot to press the clicker. So I'm Tiffany, uh, co-founder and CEO of Mila. Mila is a research-based, AI-driven platform matching people to their best fit psychologist. In a very crude sense, we are like a Tinder for psychologists, ensuring our patients are matched to some really good therapy. And I was actually inspired to build Mila during my psychology studies. So much so, I quit the clinical path to build this company because I fundamentally believe we're doing mental health tech all wrong, compromising clinical outcomes and quality care. Today, mental health tech has been optimized for speed and accessibility. There's been a huge effort to put the networks online and guarantee patients a session within 48 hours, which is super well-intentioned and sounds amazing in theory, but shit in practice. Because faster access to any care is meaningless, if not harmful, if the care or the therapist isn't right for you. Let me explain. When I was 18, I was in a pretty traumatic event, and I tried to seek help afterwards. I went to my doctor, who told me it would be several months before I would have an appointment. With my college exams approaching, I decided to search by myself. I opened Google, I typed in good psychologist near Manchester, and I was given nine million hits. It was like trying to find a needle in a haystack. I eventually found a site that could guarantee I could have a session within 48 hours. Perfect, sign me up. Fast forward 36 hours, I'm sat across from my therapist, who I'm sure was a wonderful woman, but was a terrible match and a terrible therapist for me. I had just two sessions and I wasn't helped. I am not the exception. Today, 50% of all patients entering therapy will quit on or before session three. And on average, patients will have to test three to five different psychologists before they find their best fit. What is going on here? What is happening? Is there just a bunch of shit psychologists everywhere? The short answer is no. One thing um, that research has shown this is happening is because of a bad match. And this is also shown in my DMs as well. Now, a bad match can mean poor personal chemistry or the therapist just wasn't clinically competent to treat your specific issues or needs. A bit of a secret in the industry is that therapists are not clinical generalists, meaning they're really good at treating some issues and problems and actually quite bad subclinical at treating others. So the same therapist who's amazing for me could be terrible for you. So when we randomly assign patients to psychologists, when we just randomly assign them to the next available therapist without any matching, we're ultimately leaving it down to the factor of luck as to whether it's going to be a good match or not. We're leaving it down to luck as to whether you will see a clinically competent therapist for your specific needs. And the question is, should we really believe in the quality and outcomes of people's mental health care down to luck when mental illness is now the disease burden of the globe, costing our society $2.5 trillion a year? What if there was a way that we could leverage data and research to try and understand and predict how to create a good match between a patient and a psychologist to ensure that patients can get the right help from the right therapist from the start? Well, there is a way, the meal away. 
When I was at school, I spoke to experts, researchers who were experts on patient therapist matching, got licensed to use their work, and built the world's first matching algorithm, optimized to calculate the perfect match between a patient and a therapist. And this is how it works. Patients will answer our matching questionnaire, where they answer about 65 questions where we take a holistic data set of their clinical needs, personal preferences, and personality metrics. Our algorithm then matches them to their top five psychologists, who are the most personally compatible and clinically competent and qualified to treat them. And it's bloody working. We've reduced patient dropout on or before session three to just 2.2%. Remember, industry standard is 50, and this is with thousands of patients. So in other words, we reduce the chances of you finding a shit psychologist by 98%. And people are truly loving our product. We have thousands of testimonials like this. And we see both our patients and therapists being our biggest cheerleaders in Sweden's largest digital communities. And if you're wondering what happened to Lavisa, she did come to Mila, she did find her best fit psychologist, and this was her feedback. We launched in Sweden March this year, and we've been growing fucking phenomenally ever since. Patient submissions have been growing by 104% month on month, and we're seeing real stickiness in the product, with patients averaging 15 sessions with their match therapist. And our revenues? We've grown our revenues by over 1,600% since launch, from 2,000 euros to over 50,000 euros in monthly revenue. And I actually got a gorgeous text from my accountant today who said that we were operationally profitable for this month. Of course, we see a massive opportunity in the B2B space as well, where we can outperform current insurance providers at a price competitive point because of our scalable technology. And we're even in talks today with companies like Volvo on how we can become their mental health partner. We're raising in Q1 next year, where that capital will allow us to launch in my hometown, the UK, where over 8 million people last year went to private therapy. For us to reach 1 million in ARR, we would need to capture just 0.07% of that market. We have an audacious vision and we have the perfect team to execute it, with many of us having previous experience in startup and some of us even exiting past startups. We have a competent board, chairwoman, and exceptional investors, many of whom have operational experience building and scaling unicorns such as CRI, Tink, and Joint Academy. So who's ready to join us on our mission of matching millions of people worldwide to their best fit psychologist? Because we believe the world would look a lot bloody different if we all had some good therapy. Thank you so much. Thank you.